What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Model WordPress Teams and in today's video you're gonna learn how to add a top notification bar or a top banner into your WordPress website to share some notes about promotion, about some important notification, some alert about the most effective way to share content to all your site visitors about some promotion for example, okay? All for free without coding and in a fully customizable method. But before I can continue, please take a moment to hit the subscribe button, like this video and share this content for a friend of yours. You have no idea how much it helps us. So let's get this started. First thing, go to our WordPress dashboard and review the left sidebar of menus, okay? Just before I can continue, we're gonna apply a notification bar into the top section of our site. So before the logo, before the menus, okay? So into the top section between the browser tab and the logo type of our site. So go to WordPress dashboard, review the left sidebar of menus and hover mouse over plugins and click into the submenu, add new plugin. Into the upper right corner of our screen, next to search plugins, we're gonna click into this little field right here and type WP front notification bar. All we have to do is click on install now. Mine is called activate because I already have it installed. But yours is gonna look like this. Install now. Click on install now. Wait a moment and then click into the activate button. The plugin gonna redirect you to the plugin settings page. If this does not happen with you, just go to your WordPress dashboard view left sidebar of menus, hover mouse over settings, and you're gonna be able to see a new submenu next to privacy into the under the settings menu. Call it notification bar. The first, the most important one option right here for us, it's the enable, okay? You need to mark this option. Then you're gonna scroll down. We can change the position. You can share the bar into the top or into the bottom of our site. We can make it fix it at the, uh, the position or not. We can display on screw or not. We can apply some offsets, some H, position offset, display after one second, animation duration, display close button. You can display a close button to this bar or not, up to you. Auto close after, display shadow, display reopen button, reopen button, your image or L, button offset, keep close it, keep close it for. So we have a lot of options right here, okay? Set max views, max views. Let me hit the save change button into the upper right corner of my screen so I can show you the notification bar. Here is my site homepage. Wait a second. Here is the notification bar. As soon as I scroll down, the notification appeared. How to make it appear by default? No problem. We're gonna unmark this option right here. Display on screw. Hit the save change button once again. Here is our not notification bar. It keeps always active unless the person clicks into this X button. How to change the content of this bar? No problem. Scroll it down and move to the content option. Right here we can type the content that we want. For example, why mine is free shipping, but you can call, for example, summer sale. You can say some important notes about your site, about your hosting, about your, about your, the content of your site, for example. Okay, so something that needs help, for example, a survey. You, you can type everything right here, and you can apply codes into the section in the case that you want, for example. Okay, what else you can do? You can process short code. You can display a button or not. You can enter the button test. We can change the button text URL. Okay, so if a person click into this button, we're gonna hit be redirected to a new URL. And if you scroll down just a little bit, we can change a filter to apply any start date or an add date to make the button appear across all your site page or just a certain amount of pages on your site and exclude some pages of your site. You can make the button appear to all your users, to some logging users, to guest users, okay? Or by user rules, and you can change the button colors, okay? For example, let me make a darker button. The message text color can be changed as well. The button color can be changed as well. The button text color can be changed as well.
Let me hit the save change so we can review the results we got. And here we go. A nice way to display a banner, don't you think? Easy, simple, works for free. If you screw down just a little bit, you have extra options to apply CSS classes, okay? To apply custom CSS. And there is. If you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question, I'm gonna be happy in talking to you. And please, don't forget to check out our Borderless WordPress plugin, the best free WordPress plugin that when you install, you gain widgets, elements, templates, and tools to build up your site using Elementor, Gutenberg, WP Bakery, and many, many more extra features, all for free, downloaded on WordPress.org. In addition, we for Enzo WordPress team, a team that gives you pre-built up sites that you can import with a single click, also downloaded on WordPress.org, it's the best free WordPress team. Moreover, in the case that I want to submit your blog for receiving and publishing guest posts or to find a blog to collaborate with, go to growth with 3 wsnet and find a collaborator or a old trash right here, okay? In addition, in the case that I want to promote your site, your app, your landing page, your game design, go to sites.gallery, you can submit your blog for free, you can submit your site for free, your app, your game, okay? You can be promoted right here on our CSS gallery. And finally, in the case that you want to go premium while doing your site, go to visualmoto.com and purchase the Visual Moto Pass and go premium. So you're gonna have access to all our WordPress themes, plugins, icons, templates, assets, and of course, hundreds of pre-built websites that you can import with a single click. In addition for pre-built templates, icons, widgets, blocks, and many, many more tools to create the site of our dreams. And that is, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I see you tomorrow. All the best.